um, I found a uh, little baby dog on the street, wild dog. So I brought home and I called the wild uh, rehabilitation center because they, they don't want the baby. So I kept it and you know, raised them. Mm -hmm. you then, raised them. yeah. Then a few eventually. months later, I let them out, you know, mm -hmm. go back to the wild, right? Then I saw, oh, you know, I was so heartbroken. But next day, I saw one bird on the electric wire that I called his name. And he just come right straight to me. And next day, female came back and she said, she came back too. I called her name. She said, came back. That makes me so happy, you know. That's just one of my best experience. Mm -hmm. And that's how we found bird tricks. Bird because, tricks, then yeah. we now we research, oh, this is uh, so cool, I had to do it. He said we just need to quiz Nicole on wind. Yeah. <laughs> so if you set him here, you go that way just like they're doing. Yeah. You kind of did a crosswind, but you still got pushed right into you. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Come on, Rachel, get on that. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Momo! <laughs> Actually, Momo, when he was clipped, he saw the doves fly, and then I feel like he really wanted to fly. Yeah, that's the encouraged. So we him. really wanted to free fly yeah, him. Yeah, very much. Yeah, that encouraged him to oh, train. Sorry, sorry. Yeah. Was for four months because he came February, and now it's August, September. So four months it took him to fly. He was yes. an adopted clipped bird, and he only had one tail, and a lot of you know feathers that were clipped. His wing feathers, his primary feathers were clipped. The Momo. biggest struggle yes. was. You know, he shut down a lot during training. And yeah. so stubborn. Very stubborn. And bitey. Bitey. <laughs> <laughs> Even target stick, he just turned around. He said, no. You know, yes. That I was think like a really teenager. But I feel like those struggles made him a better gala, better momo. And yeah. also, Dave helped us so much. Yeah. And he's so patient with my bad English. <laughs> <laughs> I'm originally from Japan. I really appreciate that. Then, you know, diet. <laughs> 
yeah, we keep record his weight every day. Every day, that's yeah. help. Because now my friends have birds and they're like, oh, you're free flying? Like, I want to do that too. And my Japanese family, they know I always do new weird things. <laughs> <laughs> so they, oh, Mika started something new and very weird things again, you know? But now yeah. I show them, you know, what I do, yeah. my video. They're like so cool. They're yeah. very impressed. And we eventually want to free fly these two guys. These two guys yes. to join to the flock. Yes. Uh, okay, so Momo! Momo! Look at him go! <laughs> She's like, Woo! She don't want it. She like just hurt me. Mama! 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 I like it that he's returning to the flock. You know? Yeah, yeah, it's good. Look at her. Totally different dynamic. Yeah. Yeah. When I saw him fly, Really? Yeah, it was uh, beautiful. I, yeah, I cried. You know? Yeah, we cried. Yeah, speechless. Yeah, Momo was having fun and we're like, oh. He looked so happy. Miracles still happen. Momo's little sheep. He's just kissing. Uh, <laughs> 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 a lot of energy. What was that? Momo! That click was pretty late. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. Uh, Way too late, right? That's the thing, that how you click. I'm still learning. <laughs> still learning. learning from a book compared to from a person training you Dave. is different. Dave, totally who's our personal different. trainer. Because all bird is different, all person is different, and all training session, you know, yeah, yeah different. Yeah. And also, amazingly, small things make big difference. Very secure. And the telemetry is, uh, yeah. I think it's re really necessary. I recommend to everybody, yeah. you know, then only three grams and the, he's so, you know, small bird and the GPS is a 10 gram. I talked to Marshall and the, I saw like uh, really worry about, oh, he might notice that he doesn't like it, but he doesn't even notice that. He's so light and so useful, you know, I recommend to everybody. I'm going to show you how to set up the telemetry. I turn it on here. If I point at this, I'm not getting a signal, which means it's off. I take my magnet, hold it down. Three beeps means it's on, five means it's off. And now I'm getting a signal. So now we have to put on the bird. Come on, Momo. So I'm gonna pinch this together. 
And I gotta find his tail mount. Yeah, it's pretty hidden in there. There we go. Can we see? Uh, catch that. Stick it in. So just pop open at the end, and then pull it down. Yeah, very easy. Yeah. And Momo that he doesn't. We thought he would hate yeah, it. He, yeah. yeah. He doesn't even notice that he has a tail clip. Just like.